Hello children. This video is specially made for you. Let us learn about the topic for today that is the sentence. This is going to be our video number 1 for class 3. Now you all can see here I have written few words in capital letters and they are placed in boxes. There are one, two, three, four boxes and in which the words are actually four to five. The above mentioned words are called jumbled words. These all words one, two, three, four. These all words are called jumbled words. These words when arranged properly form a sentence. So, the correct sentence for the above words become children love to eat mangoes. Because if we unsolve these uh, jumbled words, this first word will become mangoes. Second word will become eat. Two. Third word will become love. And the fourth word will become children. So, the sentence becomes Children love to eat mangoes because we have unsolved this puzzle and we have made it right in a form of a sentence because it is making sense now. Earlier these words were not making any sense because they were not placed properly to form a sentence. Right? Now let us see what is a sentence. As you all can see, I have written here the question, what is a sentence? A group of words which make complete sense and expresses a thought is called a sentence. A sentence is a, a, a sentence always begins with a capital letter and ends with a question mark, full stop, and sometimes with exclamatory mark also. So, what we have recaptured here is that the words which we place in order to form complete sense and each word expresses a thought. Okay, so this is called a sentence. I have written it uh, many examples here. The first example is a is David, boy, good. So these all are in a form of a jumble words. So, but I have put slashes as you can see these uh, slashes in between so that we can separate one word from the another word. So if I solve this first puzzle, it will become David is a good boy. And then because we are ending the sentence, we have to put a full stop here. And the first word will be capital. Come to second example. You were going are. So if we solve this, it will become where are you going? Yes, it is making sense now. Come to third. Am to birthday party. I a going. Again, if we solve it, it will become I am going to a birthday party. Then fourth one is a lovely it such dress. And I have put an exclamation mark here because it is expressing a thought. So if I solve it, it will become such a lovely dress it is. Right. So these all are the words which have been formed in a form of a sentence. So, this is called sentence. Right? So, I hope this topic, so I hope this topic is clear to you all. Last but not least, take care of yourself and stay at home.